The Brazilian online sensation Larissa Olivier has conquered the hearts of millions with her rock music covers and amazing guitar playing skills. From her beginnings on YouTube to gaining several million followers across social media platforms, Larissa has proven that music has no boundaries when, such as in her case, it's done amazingly well. Whether you knew about Larissa recently or have been familiar with her for a while, you probably have many questions about her whereabouts, plans for the future, the projects she's been involved in, the challenges she's overcome, and even from where she originates. So what's going on with Larissa Olivier? And how did she become such a big internet sensation? Keep watching to find out everything about her. Larissa Olivier has become known by anyone who appreciates talent and rock music. She started her career as a content creator in 2020, and since then has gained over 5.5 million followers across all social media, though YouTube remains her biggest platform. She's been noticed by music-related brands such as Marshall and international specialized news platforms and magazines such as Femme Metal and Guitar World. In 2023, Larissa joined the Brazilian all-female rock band Honey Bomb as a lead guitarist, but left the band a year later to focus on her own projects. Despite her short-lasting stay with the band, it was a dream come true for Larissa, who told Guitar Thrills in 2024 that playing alongside incredible bands and musicians was one of the goals she was aiming to accomplish before turning 25 years of age. In the same interview, Larissa revealed that she was working on new and original music, though just a few months later she hasn't revealed any further details. Besides sharing her music covers on YouTube, TikTok, and other social media, Larissa's work is also available through the membership platform Patreon, on which her most committed followers can access her exclusive content while supporting her music career. All in all, Larissa might be an internet celebrity already, but she's still taking big steps towards accomplishing her music dreams. Larissa shared her first YouTube video in October 2020, and since then, hasn't stopped attracting followers. Her content has always been centered around rock and metal music, sharing guitar covers of famous songs such as by Metallica and Led Zeppelin. Regarding her beginnings as a content creator, Larissa told Guitar World that she was compelled to create videos when the COVID-19 wave hit and she had to stay home. Seeing herself with nothing much to do and her engineering studies suspended, Larissa chose to film herself playing the songs she loved and posting them on the internet, although she also confessed that in the beginning there was no clear plan while making her videos. Eventually, Larissa's videos took off as she learned how to improve her production. Nowadays, she takes good care of camera angles, editing details, and sounds to catch the viewer's attention. While her long-duration YouTube videos have gained her millions of views, the format which serves her best is short videos, which she posts across all social media. These days, Larissa has surpassed the 3 million subscribers mark on YouTube, while her TikTok boasts almost 750,000 followers. Her Instagram is followed by over 300,000 people following her there, demonstrating how well Larissa has played her cards when it comes to online virality. Larissa Olivier's love for music began long before she started creating any content. As she recalled in an interview with Femme Metal in 2022, Larissa was first enthralled by rock music when she started playing the Guitar Hero video game series as a little kid, describing the experience as a feeling of power and happiness. It didn't take long before that hobby turned into a full-fledged passion, though it wasn't until she was eight years old and received a real guitar as a Christmas gift, which changed her life. Her fascination with guitars continued over the years, though her learning process had been solely through YouTube tutorials up to the time her online fame took off in 2020. Larissa comes from Juraz, a state in southeastern Brazil, and was born in 2002. Before the pandemic hit, Larissa was studying engineering but later shifted to architecture, as the magazine Guitar Thrills revealed in 2024. These days, she's fully dedicated to creating music while also supporting herself through brand sponsorships, earnings from views on her videos, and her subscription platforms. All of this leaves no doubts about the great path that Larissa has walked so far and how much potential she has to accomplish her goal of being a superstar. Despite her massive fame and undeniable talent, Larissa Olivier has also dealt with a lot of misogyny and sexism on social media. When asked about this by the magazine Guitar Thrills, Larissa affirmed that gender bias was something she faced not only at the beginning of her career, but also well into it. According to Larissa, most of the harsh comments from the men and not women, with the latter group often being an inspiration to her creative endeavors. 
Larissa also emphasized how women in the music industry should work together and join forces to overcome misogyny. That being said, it wasn't always easy for Larissa to see things this way. As she confessed to Femme Metal in 2022, the sexist comments she received when she started posting videos on the internet took a toll on her, leading her to reconsider her choices of clothing and style. Nevertheless, she soon realized that she had no control over the things other people thought about her, describing people who threw hate at her as narrow-minded. As she said in the same interview, Larissa is now focused on developing her talents even more and recognizing the efforts she has made to get where she's at. Seeing how far Larissa Olivier has come and how much she's accomplished at such a young age, her advice about dealing with the industry is more than welcome. For a start, Larissa recommends having an open mind when it comes to searching for one's place in music. As she told Guitar Thrills, one of the reasons she hit it off so soon when she started posting videos was because there weren't many women playing rock songs on the internet, leaving her an open space for growth. Despite the negativity which came her way at the time, she found courage in people's positive comments and her own will to accomplish great things with her music. Regarding her advice to other people finding their way into music, Larissa affirms that finding people to look up to, staying on track, and studying are some of the most important aspects of making it through the music industry, besides going after those dreams in the first place. All of this leaves no doubts about why Larissa has come so far, as courage, willpower, and talent are essential parts of who she is. We look forward to her further development and contributions to the music industry. Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.